Welcome back, my loyal subjects of Funk to this Let's Funking play of, oh shit, of um, the fall of the Western Roman Empire, and things are going absolutely spiffing. We are getting closer and closer and closer to winning this campaign. The next move is to eradicate not only the Franks, but um, the Alamans, and we need some heavy siege equipment for that, I think. The thing is, we're going into uh, uh, France, and that's not very good for fertility during um, during the winter months, which is going to fuck us up. They should be quite weak, though, I think, according to this. Um, however, however, as you'll find out in a second, I think we'll be fine, because of all the provinces we have recovered in Africa, all being coastal provinces, we are bringing so much fish into the Empire right now. We are bringing a shitload of fish into the Empire. We have long admired your Can't do it, sir. Cannot do it. So let's go ahead and start as the process. Uh, Africa's public order is dropping. Rebellion imminent. How the fuck? Oh, here. Oh, peace, Moria. Oh, shit. We don't need them all making peace with each other. We want to keep them all fighting. Right, food uh, storage in. Fuck's sake. Right, we've got plus eight there at the moment, though. That's really good. Um, we've got plus three here, minus one there. Oh, we're sorting out this public order so fast now, guys. Plus five here now. How are we doing here? Minus seven. I think we did put some things in place to try and sort this out, but um, I'm not quite sure how it's going at the moment. Food minus 90, so we're getting minus 9 from food. We'll have to sort that out very shortly. And um, let's look down here. We're going to have a minus 4 there. That's where we're going to have the rebellion, but we're not because we're going to bring this chump into Carf Carthage and he can sit there and guard that like a demon. Um, minus 4 here at the moment. Will sort itself out hopefully in X amount of turns. We've got fish and wharfs there as well. So we've got a lot of. This is winter and we're getting 400 food in winter. So we have bounced back like funk. Um, I want to bring this guy into Narbo. Right, that's a plus six at the moment. Where's my navy? How is this doing as well? That's back at plus one. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and we're bringing this navy over to I Palma, and if the thing goes up sufficiently, we will send him. To the front lines as well because what we need if I send him to Narbo just for a turn am I correct in thinking that we can buy siege equipment no we can't how are we doing here as well did we stabilize that we did we're getting plus four there now plus 13 plus 11 plus five my god we're doing we have bounced back here guys we are, we own this spot this spot's not doing so good mind you um, it's not doing very good at all, actually. Neither is this spot. Let's go ahead and get some fishing jetties. Level 2. Um, got more fishing jetties there as well. Unlocks the recruitment of elite patin palatinas, but I might get rid of that if I need to. Fudorati's in Sagittari. Uh, might get rid of that as well. I don't know. We're just doing amazing at the moment. Um, right, I might have to move him there for a couple of turns as well. Because this isn't helping. Have we got a food problem here? We're getting minus 14 from food. And uh, we're going to have to build some food here. Fairly fucking fast. What do we have in the way of a military port? Well, fuck that. We're going to have a fishing port now. Because that is by far the best way to spend the money. Right, so... I'm not quite sure where we're going to get this artillery from. I think it must be here. Is this the spot with the artillery? Cavalry stables. Colonia. Somewhere. Was well, it down here? Ah, it is down here. Right, so we'll send him down here to hire next turn. And we'll get him some artillery. 
and we'll do the same with this, these armies. This guy here that's coming across, he is going to get himself some nice artillery and then he'll be sent to Vienna where we can swap some units for better units as well. And we're just going to plough straight into the Alamans and the Franks and just remove them entirely from the game. Um, we're going to push them right back, we're going to go right up to the to Gaul and once we've reached Gaul we'll consolidate for a bit and then um, we will yeah might even declare one of the Picts as well that'll be a bit of a a problem for them hope this sorts itself out because I can't spare any more armies at the moment and come on destroy this for Christ's sake these lots should be ready to fold I'm keeping this guy here in an attempt to um, misdirect any armies that come down because I want a grandma to fold so that we can um, they, that will become their settlement then, their problem, but they've got a military alliance with us so we can become one step closer to winning this campaign if that um, folds. Get the fuck in, boys. We are sorting this out. What are these doing? I don't like that. Oh, they must be still at war with... Uh, they must be still at war with the Hispania, and if if they lose a settlement, I'll move in and take it straight like that. If Hispania lose the settlement, I want them to lose. This is wonderful. So it's only a matter of time now before we fulfil the minor victory conditions, but then um, there's we could go for the long campaign, which would we, we would need to fully complete this uh, a hundred and twenty. Um, 120 provinces um, settlements. Oh my god, look at that. Only good news this time. That's really good. How's this going? Minus 5, it's went down, it's went worse. Um, Carfago's going good. Gonna bring this guy over to Narbo. This guy here is gonna go straight up to Pompello. And he'll probably stay there as well because if we're fighting up here. We'll probably need him around this area. Going to move this guy down to Taraco. And then we will have a look. What can we hire here? Do we want... We could just do with one set of uh, large onagers. So I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, let me get rid of these for now. I'm going to go ahead and upgrade these. We'll probably replace all of these very shortly. Um, this guy's going to come into Narbo. He's got a very nice army. But I am uh, I'm thinking oh yes. I'm I'm thinking about yeah, we'll disband these. Um I might even what can he hire from Narbo? Yeah, skidding. Piss off. Um hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of that as well. We have good cavalry here, like, and we've it's got upgrades as well. Oh there is there is uh, an option for onagers around here. I mean when we attack these lot and we'll do it in the summer months we'll be next summer when it comes around we're going to be going straight into Lugdunum which is going to be wonderful. Right we need another we've we got here five Palatinas. I'm going to go ahead and hire one of these as well. I'm not, the, this guy can have the large onagers um, this guy can go up to Vienna. We'll move him back up here and we'll hire the rest of our troops that we need there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and... What am I going to do? We've got shit units available here. So, yeah, we don't want too many onagers. I mean, how much are the ones... Yeah, they're less than half for two of them. So I'm just going to get one set of large onagers for this army. Wonderful news for the king. Wonderful news. I'm going to go ahead and convert these. I really don't like it when my settlements are not Romanic. And it's not good for garrisons either. If we have a look here, yeah. We need to get that fixed. Because we could come under attack and we're going to need the garrison if we do. To help us. I'll move this guy over here. We could do with hiring a fleet here now for the upcoming campaign. Um, we can have six fleets. So we could go ahead and reinstate a navy. 
and we'll just do it with a guy who's got low influence. He's a he's a handler, which makes him good at recruiting agents. Again, a handler. Again, whenever we need, it's shit like. Whenever we need the right stuff. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. It's going to take a while to build this, but hopefully by next summer, the following summer after this, we'll be ready to go in. Bam! Bam! I'm going to go. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use this guy, go straight into Lugdunen. Um, let's have a look here. What do we want? Defence. I'm going to definitely need some defence there. Charge bonus for command unit over default. Um, blah, 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 blah. Minus 10%. Upkeep for ranged infantry units. Yeah, this guy isn't the best army in the world, and to be honest, I don't really want him. Ah, oh, fuck, we'll get him that. And we'll get him. Authority when leading the navy, ain't that? Research, tax rate, local province, cunning, battle movement speed for commander unit. What's this here? Upkeep for cavalry, minus 10%. That's really good. Um, We'll get him all three of them units. He's not going to be the best army in the world, as you can see. But, um when he takes Rezontio we will be sorted. Let's have a look actually I mean who? what sort of... Right, these have got a military alliance with them and a defensive alliance with the Abdanians which are yeah we'll be back at war with them but this is going to be it guys we're going to move in we're going to take it let's have a look on this now 57 we're going to take the whole of uh, we're going to take the whole of France back and then Britain and uh we need to keep an eye on these as well. I really want to make peace with them. I have no like qualms with these lot at all. I might have to beat them in a battle at some point. I'm only at war with three people at the moment. She's just absolutely phenomenal. Right, who's this here? Who were right? No, we've pretty much got all the trade deals we can get in this. There'll probably be yeah a rebellion the turn after next, so we'll have to move him to to there but we'll go ahead end turn let's end more turns guys because we can't fuck about here all day but we are getting so much closer to winning this campaign now and it feels monstrously <coughs> good oh i'm stretching because i've been I've, I've just like i've decided right not to record any more videos until i have um until i've completed this campaign um and so I want to get this one out the road so then I can go and uh, record some other videos like uh, Mountain Blade and finish off Baldur's Gate and stuff. That's right. Maybe my Baldur's Gate Let's Plays are well finished by the time you see this. In fact, it should be. Because I've recorded like a month's worth of uh, uh, this series at the moment. Which is just crazy to think about. Absolutely crazy. Ah. Nah, can't do it, and I won't do it. So these lot, we effectively own them. They're like client states, really. I wish they were client states. They'd be giving us a hell of a lot more money. Um, but they're not. They're not officially client states. Now hurry up, Hispania, and take over that last bloody area. Starve it out, man. I want you to take it. Just take it for fuck's sake. It's doing my head right in. Right, okay, we're going to keep our eyes peeled for this. We're actually not at war with them, but I will take it off them if they conquer it. If they go in and conquer it, I'll go in and fucking fuck shit up. And my uh, military allies will love it. But it seems so weird not having a red, la red thing around there faction at the moment. I find that really interesting. Right, Hispania. No, sorry, pal. Okay. Natural causes. 57 years old. Oh, cancel. Franks and Abdanians are at war now, which is nice. Gonna move this guy up to here. Because it could be a separatist. I hope it is a separatist and they go up there and uh, occupy that. Okay. Right. So, if they decide to move that out of there, they're going to get absolutely smashed to pieces. Ah, shit. 
Right, what have we got here? Do we want this guy to go up to Vienna? Yes, we do. We want this guy to go back up to Narbo. Because he's going to be the one who fucks shit up here. As soon as they move their army out of there, I will go. And I will hammer them so hard. Um, in fact, what do we want here? What do we want? I want to get rid of you. I want to replace it with basically shock cavalry. Um, I want to get rid of both of these. I don't want any more than four Palatinas either. Um, I want... What do I want? One, two, three, four, five units we can hire. And we'll go ahead and hire... I'm going to get rid of all these as well. Fuck it. We're going to make a super army. What? Christ. In two turns we'll have this full again. I am going to get then two of these. Fuck it. They're going to be expensive but who gives them monkeys? Um, four units of cavalry. Two of them. Two of these. And we'll get two more of these everything will be done in two turns and we will move back into there and then we'll be ready, that army will be ready be very ready, about as ready as it could ever be right what happens if we move him into here now if it's not good enough which it probably won't be minus one okay minus one isn't bad I might go and send him up to we've got minus one there as well We'll probably complete the campaign before that rebels. Uh, plus 18, I'm going to move him up to nowhere. I'm going to go and hire some troops for him as well. We're just building such a sweaty army right now. Are you ready to serve? I am ready to serve. Um, how's this guy doing? He's doing good. Right, 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 right. And he's at the Alans as well. The I'm going to leave that one because I don't want that one you see. How far were we planning to conquer? Ah. We were planning to conquer. Yes. Okay. This here. This here. We don't want that. We don't want that. So I'm just going to use this guy to be an absolute defensive uh, guy. Do we have... Where's our other spies at? We did have one round somewhere around here, didn't we? We've got one down here. Ah, they've took it. Finally. Finally they've taken that. Minus seven, you're taking a fucking piss. <sighs> right, so that's getting given plus two public order. That one gives growth. Seven public order infantry thing. Let's is any I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. And we're going to put a public order building in. Why the fuck not? Um, how are we doing? This guy's just sitting there chilling. That's going to be done in two turns. This guy is stacked to pieces. He is ripped to pieces. And he will go in and rip up Lugdunen. In such a fast amount of time. I am thinking about bringing this guy down to... I mean, do they, they do have... Um, artillery here. Yes, I'm going to. Hmm. I'm going to bring him here for now. And bring this guy over to Vienna for now. He's just gone through their lands. They should get scared. Which gives us a chance to hire. One, two, three, four. Let's just see what happens. Abdanians and Franks are now at war again. Caledonians emerge, which is strange. Haven't had that in a while. Right, let's end turn. Let's fuck shit up. We are preparing for this war. I mean, ten thousand coins a turn. That's fine for me. Um, I'm pretty. I'm just happy with it being stable now until we take over the entire entirety of the empire that we need. So. We might have a civil war next turn as well because of that uh, settlement that we created in Greece. And we'll have to be careful as well because 
we're going to have problems with that new faction we have encountered in the Russian area of this uh, a game. But it would be nice to get back up to Hadrian's Wall. It would be so nice, and I'd go ahead and just conquer the fucking lot. And that should give us enough to actually win us this campaign once we've done that. So it's good that um, I'm really pleased to hear the Hispania have kicked out finally that faction. If we had just left them, because I was tempted to leave them and not help them, but us just moving that one army from Palma. Whoa. Well, that's nice, Germantians. Well, you lot keep doing that, because eh? you are. I'd rather you conquer them so that you help our cause a bit better, but. If that's what you want, that's what you can have. Yeah, the war is coming to Europe, though. We've conquered everything we need to conquer for now. We just need to do with Greece. And the thing is, now that we've kicked out all these other nations from Africa, we know where we stand. Like, all the, all the fighting's going to be in the east, so I don't have to keep thinking about watching my back again in Africa. So that makes me very happy. Very, very happy. But we are going to roll over Europe so hard. It's going to make them cry. But we're going to use onagers. We're going to have so many onagers this time, so we can just walk in and fucking ruin them. Here we go, it's winter. Winter is here, is here. Alamans and the Rugians get in. Right, we're going to love each other, Alamans and the Rugians. And that's good as well, because I don't want any of their land. Might even be a future trading partner. Alright, very nice. We'll go ahead and get... Replenishment up. Food shortage solved. Right, how are we doing here now? Minus one still. Minus two. Minus two, seventeen, eleven. We're gonna need to do work some magic around here, guys. Oh, we do have the option to build something that's gonna bring up public order. Sanitation, we don't need as of yet. Do we have sanitation buildings? We do have a uh, aqueduct. We probably need to get another though, and then we'll go to hell to lever on getting this spot industrialized. Yeah, okay, that's good. We've got boats there. Uh, uh, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of some of these as well. Because we don't really need them. These are going to be more for support. Right, so we're still building a load of units there. Uh, and what do we want here? We want to get rid of this for a start. Let's have a look see if we can get some... Uh... Oh, we can. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of both of them. And we will go ahead and hire one of them. Brings up to 19. And um, one of these. It's going to take two turns. Oh, I knew it was going to fucking do that. Um, we're going to move this guy up to Octundurum. And that's a good thing as well. He's probably our strongest army right now. Apart from the one in uh, Greece. Have we got the rebellion here? We have got the rebellion here now. We'll let that grow for a single turn. I oh, know we want. Didn't we convert this? No, we'll do it now. Needs to be converted. Because I think they could probably take this over next turn. Yeah, so we'll go ahead and show it who's boss now. But well, we're going to get that gold. And we're going to fund this entire thing on gold soon. That's a really good army, that. Might even get some onages out of this. If we're lucky, or some b Ballistari. And I. Oh god, we lost one of the fucking Palatinas. And so I'm gonna kill them. Damn it! I think we did get some Ballistari, did we there? No, we didn't. We didn't even get anything. Fuck's sake. We'll just move him back into our lands. Gonna be another rebellion in another couple of turns. Um, public order plus two, yes. I wouldn't mind them just for a laugh. Don't know what the hell they do. 
I put public order up and we are going to put up integrity as well right and another thing we're going to do which we forgot to do which is to right now start giving some commands to the boys let's do that can't believe look my power is fucking failing man we're gonna have some real fucking serious problems soon I have no way of fixing it as well cuz I just who the fuck is he as a governor we need to remove him <sighs> what has happened to the royal family I don't get it at all fuck man Okay, let's um Right, it's this guy here, you would say. Let's go on his thing. Oh, bloody hell. I'm gonna kick him out. I'm gonna adopt a new governor there. Let's have a look. Where are we at? Family in Liguria. That's right, fuck off, mate. This guy is a statesman with five loyalty. Handler, taskmaster. That's a pity we had an administrator earlier. I'll put him back in Liguria. There we go. Yeah, it'll take another turn before we can get that in order, but hey. So yeah, this guy's going to stay here, and this guy's going to stay there, and they're all going to do the joint invasion together. This guy's just going to sit there doing his own thing. If we can get, how many... We have all three spies. I don't know where the hell they are. Oh, of course, right. I'm going to use this guy. He's got no army there at the moment. Right, next turn, he's going to move there. He's got to move there, and in the next turn we're going to... Oh, going to be a few more turns before we can just... Right, anyway guys, I'm going to end it here, so thanks for watching, I'll catch you later, goodbye. <laughs>